before we get into the video, if you guys want the best quality on your screen, make sure to press the settings and turn it up to 1080p. Also, if you want some captions, if you speak a different language, go to the bottom of your screen, press this button, go over to settings, and you will see an option to press onto subtitles, go to auto translate, and you have got hundreds of languages to select from. Enjoy the video, lads. What is going on lads? Welcome everybody back to another FIFA 22 video. Today we're going to be looking at this new preseason transfer in Dombele. Similar to Gabriel Jesus, this will take you 5 games and it is incredibly easy to do. Before we get into this as well, if you guys are new, make sure to drop a like on the video and subscribe. And as well, check me out on Twitch. We stream 5 days a week and we will be live tonight opening a lot of 85 times 10 packs for preseason batch 2. And we'll then make that into a YouTube video. So make sure drop a like subscribe follow me on twitch for twitter links are in the bio and enough plugging myself let's get in to the video so first of all you've got a sister goal using french players in five separate squad battle matches on at least professional difficulty now assist using a french player very very easy lots of you guys might have some french players in your starting lineup anyway score four goals whilst having at least three french players in your starting 11 you've got assist three goals using through balls while having at least three french players just to clarify the through balls do not have to be with the French players. The through balls can be with a Spanish dude from the La Liga if you want, but as long as you've got those French players in the squad. And you've got score using Serie A players in five separate squad battle wins on at least professional difficulty. Almost forgot to mention, if you want an example for a through ball assist, here is an example. For a through ball assist, it is very, very easy. It is simply just triangle on the PlayStation or Y on the Xbox, and it's just a matter of trying to time that run and that through ball correctly. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to jump on over to a squad builder and then we are going to jump in to a couple tips and tricks, one of them including a squad battles tip that you can use. So for the squad builder lads and similar to Gabriel Jesus, there is no point in making a new team. Use your main team, but this is very important, alright? We've chosen three players. Ribéry, Icone, and Defrel. They may not look the prettiest, but these are the best gold French Serie A players. Two birds with one stone, because you need to score with Serie A players, and you need at least French players in your starting 11. I've already got three French players, so if you've got like a Varane, Kunde, Furlan, Mendy like myself, maybe you've got a Griezmann as well, maybe you've also got some Serie A players in your squad, then if, you've got, if you're running a French Serie A hybrid, then you're ridiculously lucky, and you can get this done without changing anything. But I know everyone's team is going to look different to mine lots of your guys team will probably not be the same team as mine right so everyone's going to be different everyone's going to be starting on a different formation in game and playing a different formation in game as well just the most important thing is that these three players here are in your starting 11 so i'll put on frank ribery for neymar i'll put defrel over renato sanchez and i'll put icone at right mid once again it doesn't look the prettiest but at least we can go into the game we've got the three french players most importantly i would say you can sub some of them off which we'll get into shortly in the first tip but Frank Ribéry is probably your key because obviously he is Serie A and you need Serie A goals so you would want to keep at least one Serie A player on you could either keep Ribéry on or what you could do is you could chuck a pause straight away sub them off and then sub on a Serie A player like Di Natale or Barella if you've got those type of players obviously once again everybody's club is different but these three players are absolutely key alright and depending on the formation you play in game you could make these guys your two strikers your cam you might play a wide formation but these players here they are very important all right and once again you can sub them off especially to Frel and Icone if you wish they're all Serie A though so just make sure you've got someone or a Serie A player on the pitch to be able to score the goals with for example, if we go to custom tactics, I play a 4-1-2-1-2 narrow. I could literally play my uh, Ribery over R9. Um, I could have my Defrel over Neymar, and then I could just play Icone at centre mid over Hullet. That way, but just getting involved, you've got those French players that, once again, you can sub off as long as you've got a Serie A player to get those goals with on the pitch. So, lads, it is honestly as simple as that. Those three players, in my opinion, are key. If you've done that Pogba showdown SBC, then you are living because French Serie A is absolutely 
absolutely, obviously, perfect. Fringe Serie A, you could, I know there's a lot of better Fringe Serie A players, but most of them are expired objectives, SBCs, or they are just quite expensive generally. Um, so those three players will cost you altogether no more than 5,000 coins. You can always sub them off, and once again, you can get it done. Now, we're going to head on over to the one and only tip today, lads. It is going to be a squad battles tip, and it is going to be very important. Now, with squad battles, as you guys will probably know, you get given four teams every single day. Often EA give you two good ones, maybe three good ones if, if you're a little bit unlucky, and then a really poor one. Sometimes the really poor one consists of really high rating with low chemistry, like we're looking at right now. But what we can do is by pressing triangle, we can view the squad. So we can go ahead go ahead and have a look at this possible opponent. Now it is some good players as expected, but lots of players off chem off chem. You've got a five foot nine left wing on zero chemistry at center back so that would probably be beatable on professional difficulty so you'll select professional go into that game now i will circle it as you can see you can update your opponents by pressing square on playstation i believe it is x on xbox now you can do this every 15 minutes all right so i'm going to refresh this here and we're going to have a look a 68 rated with 65 chemistry is absolutely perfect we would absolutely batter this team on professional so choose this team play this on professional Games are 6 minutes a half, so 12 minutes, plus you might want to add a couple minutes for going in, pauses, etc, etc. So let's just round it up and say it's a 15 minute game. It takes roughly 10 minutes for the option to come back to refresh again, which fits perfectly because by the time you've finished this game, you'll back out and you'll have the option to refresh again. So it's a constant matter of playing the worst team on in the squad battle selection, refresh and keep playing the bad team. Keep doing that, keep doing that, and keep doing that. Because obviously beating a 68 squad, 68 rate squad with 65 chemistry on professional will be miles easier than you know competing against a 90 rated squad etc if you do go over the 40 match limit as well do not worry the only thing it means is it will no longer count towards your overall squad battles rank and you will not get any points for completing the game but it will still count towards your objectives no worries so lads for a recap assist a goal using fringe players in five separate squad battle matches if you've already got some fringe players in your squad like maybe a footies griezmann a footies mendy etc then you are good to go but assist a goal using a fringe player we've got Icone, Icone De Frial, and Ribery as our three players of subbed on so you can get some assists with them or well, once again you might have another Frenchman you want to get the, get the assist with score four goals whilst having at least three French players this goal once again can be with absolutely anyone it does not have to be with a French player just as long as they're in your starting 11 assist three goals using three balls whilst having at least three French players once again, this does not have to be a through ball with a French players, but instead a through ball whilst going into the match with at least a three French players starting. And score using Serie A players in five separate matches, which is why we've gone for all of the French Serie A players, the Frau, Icone, and Ribéry. It's a matter of trying to get those three French players I just mentioned into your squad and kind of just using them. Once again, you only really need to score with one of them and you're good to go. The others of the rest of the objectives you'll just get done with other players with your main team which is why we didn't build a whole new team because i'd rather use my main team with three poor players than using like a full 11 of just average gold cards at this point of the game i'm um, starting professional as well so professional squad battles so make sure you keep refreshing your squad battles play the worst team refresh so on so forth once again this will take you five games put an estimate on it maybe one and a half hours maybe not even that maybe one and one hour 15 minutes lads good luck happy grinding make sure to once again check me out on my socials fifa 23 is going to be a big year for us so make sure to get in on the davis play stocks early and make sure to drop it a subscribe or a sub until next time boys i'll see you later